Hello everybody, Aloy Impact here. So this is going to be the first completion I have of defeating the Tui Trio as a Nalan legend. Um, these three are the literal most cancerous things in I don't know how fucking long. Vivian of the Lake and Nidian of the Lake were not this cancerous and they were really easy to solo. And I've seen other people solo these three, and I'm like, that is fucking insane. Kudos to them. Because this was actually really fucking hard. Um, and I had to do a mix of, you know, Cryo, Pyro, and, um, Cryo, Pyro, and this to be able to even break their shields and start actually, like, literally, really killing them. So, the team is basically just going to consist of Aloy, Diga, Farina, and Kazuha. Uh, because I figured that these four would be the best to actually give me enough coverage to actually break shields and still kill them. Um, I hope you enjoy the run. Alright, we're going in with Farina's skill. Thankfully, we were able to drag the sniper in. Here comes the fat boy. At this point, I'm literally just trying to make sure that they all stay in a fucking group. And I start busting shields. Like in a second, I'm gonna bust his shield. Yep. Thank goodness for Kazuo being able to have a full charge of drag back in. Because if he didn't, that sniper would literally go out there and start fucking murking your characters. Alright. Burst. Burst. That's a good start. And now I don't think the sniper trying to hit me. There we go. I can't get any kind of cryo almost in because if they're separated like this, they can take any advantage that they can. They will fucking kill me. And no life support. And it's just really crazy how Overload doesn't really contribute to destroying the Electro Hammer Dude Shield, but Cryo is the thing that does. I mean, I guess that's fine, but kind of weird considering it's a reaction that hurts the shield. But okay, here we go. Like, they're literally almost dead. So one thing I was told about these bosses is that these bosses have mechanics after you kill them. But I don't think I've ever seen those mechanics because I've always ended up dying before that happens. Um, so we'll probably experience them as soon as that happens. Um, uh, I guess nothing once the pyro sniper happens. Bruh, how did he hit Aloy at the last fucking moment? One that doesn't make any sense. Like, what do you mean you did that? You're gonna fucking pay for that. <laughs> I'm really glad attacking in these field does damage because that really helps, especially trying to spread Pyro. Especially if, uh, especially if, uh, Ice Cream Boy over here is not you know, backing up into the actual fire that's on the ground. <sighs> it's only two left. It's only two left. Which one's going to die first? Oh, oh looks like Ice Beam's going to die first. Oh, sorry to the Doom Dread Droid. <laughs> okay. Go, we're swirling. Oh no. What's that field on the ground? Okay, so much for healing. There goes Farina and Kazuma. Oh my god, get out of that. And he's charging. Okay. Broke shield. Via skill. Skill. Okay, big boy is dead. Thank goodness. What? 